first germination. Sweet. A little arugula, I believe. What's happening over here? That's good too. Oh. He's the first corn seedlings. That looks like corn. And then what are these, just weeds? They may just be weeds. Tough to say, but those are definitely veg. You can tell by the pattern of growth. We planted two rows of corn. Here, here. Is that corn? Is that corn? This one looks like it might be corn. This guy looks like he could be corn. Hello. All the rest of these, I guess, are just weeds. What are you? Clover, weeds, up. Oh, Jen's home. Howdy. Good, how you doing? I'm Andrew. The big day is here. You excited? Um, yeah, I'm excited. I just want to get through like tomorrow, just turn out and stuff. Right. Come on, you're working. Let's go. Is all this stuff coming in? Yeah. Oh, Jen, what is all this stuff? She's lucky she had a trailer for. Holy sh. Stuff. Where's this go? <laughs> the raccoons. You okay with that? What else? Horses? Hey, Momo. Hey, Brixton. Is that it, Jen? Where are the leech eggs? I thought I left them with you. They gotta be in something there, because I, uh, I didn't hide them on you, Jen. I know how much you want that Brixton leech egg. Well, we roll out the brown carpet for him and everything. Well, so it doesn't slip because it's Aww. Momo! Momo! What's happening to that? Oh my god! Momo! What freaking two year old is this? You want to show her around or are you putting her right in? Show her around. Um, I don't like your fencing there. It's getting in the way of my pit route. My pit bike route. I can't go up and back anymore. Well, I'm sorry, man. You're going to have to speak to the manager. He's up so high. How much shavings you got in there? I put two bales of straw and two bales of shavings. Momo, stop eating the straw. Big boy. Hey, for these stalls. Hey, where are we? I'm so happy. Aw. Hey, big boy. What? Come on. What's happening? Wow. Hey. Water in here. Why not? Well, there's going to be. Where's the well? At the front of the house. Oh, uh, yeah. Yeah. So this isn't plumbed at all? No. This so you've got a hydrant? Yes, yes. Oh, cool. You've got water then? Yeah, but no hot water. You know where the pipe runs? To the house. <laughs> Have you got any copper wire in here? Piece of 14.2 or something? No. no. I don't even know what that is. Okay, here's what you do. You don't know what that is? Do you know what it is? No, sir. Have you got any electrical wire? that you would wire a plug with? Just a piece. No. Okay. No, definitely not. Okay, Em. Yeah. Get a piece of 14-2. Okay. Strip it. Okay. So you just have the copper. Right. Right? Yeah. And you bend it in an L. And you witch it. Yeah. The copper will pick up that pipe out there. If you can do it. It'll pick up that water line. Or, and this is a little trickier, but if you get an apple branch, Apple Divining. Is it water diviners? Yes. Aren't they called? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. You get an apple branch that's shaped like a Y with a piece of it. Right. You bend it like that. Right? Yeah. And that stick will die. Boom. Yeah, the Google that. And you, as strong as you are, you can't hold it from going, going down. Mm. You know how freaky this gets? I'll tell you how freaky it gets. There used to be a hardware store in the middle of Clamber, and it was huge, and it was a supplier. Everybody used to come in and get their seed and their frickin' yeast to make moonshine and whatever. There was an old guy that owned that that used to be a well guy, right? And he had a pocket watch on a chain. And he, I, I saw it when I was a kid, and I'm telling you, it's legit. He would walk along, and when he hit water, it would start to move. 
And the old bastard would count the swings and say it's 40 feet deep. Really? Go, boys. Hold it loose and start to walk. And if you can witch, those two wires will go. And there's your water. Legit. Big first out. She says, is that dog going to be a problem? She's like, come in here, dog. Hey, Brixton. Okay, out here.